We're doing a lot of work in, at the moment in gym classes that requires a lot of body weight exercises. So that includes um, press ups, plank to press ups, planks, mountain climbers, things that um, are really easy to do with your body weight and you're doing them on your front for a reason. What we're neglecting a lot are the shoulders and back. Um, and you might be doing shoulder exercises, but when you're using the front of your body quite a lot and you're lying on it with your arms either extended or bent, you're putting a lot of pressure through those shoulder joints. So it's really important that if you are doing a higher number of exercises with your shoulders, that you're maintaining that shoulder condition um, throughout. So I'm going to go over a number of different shoulder exercises today, things that you can do with different items of equipment. So at home, and these are all things that you can buy either in the supermarket or online. Um, so uh, a small kettlebell, um, a pair of weights that you might find in the supermarket, or bands. So I'm going to start, I'm going to take you through an ideal workout using all of this equipment, and then in separate videos I'm going to show you alternatives for those exercises and do the whole workout but with just one piece of those equipment. And I'm going to focus in those two videos on the dumbbells, and the bands, because those are the things that most people have. Um, a kettlebell is handy as an addition to those two. If you're going to go out and buy any piece of equipment, I'd say start with a low weight kettlebell, uh, sorry, low weight dumbbell. Um, and if you're going to pick um, a very low weight and it starts to get too easy, you just up the number of repetitions that you do of each exercise, so repeat each exercise more times. Um, and with the bands, you can go thick on the bands and you can buy sets of bands and I've got a number of different sets on the wall here and they go thicker um, as you progress. But you want to start with just the very two thin bands um, and to give you an idea, uh, this red band, if I can find it, is um, 15 to 35 pounds, so pounds being LB. Um, so those are the kind of sizes you want um, of, of bands.